Viola, this is Noman. I got Target Alpha while it was being transported. How about you? Night Raid has just been shot down. Nebula. Viola, how about you? Preparations are all finished. Automatic repairs have been completed too. No problems so far. That's not true. Only 50% has been done. I told you, I can do it without weapons. Let me do battle with him. Slow down. Bravo will be with you soon. Listen, Viola. After this mission, you can have my Selkis. I'll give it to you. So, you prefer your new toy to the frame you used to adore? Anubis is superb. You can't imagine how good it is. The quality of an orbital frame depends on how good the runner manipulates it. Jehudi's runner is. Hi, this is Super B3. I'm heading back into the battle. I'll be there soon. I will be finished by the time you get here. Save some for me. I want to try out Anubis. I've got work to do. That's my game. Looks like um, we're fighting another boss. And this is the Viola rematch. Is it around here? No one's here. What? I detect an enemy presence ahead. You're doing very well. Shut up! How did you feel when you killed them? Shut up! Shut up! Ah! You! You killed my friends! Well, what if I did kill them? Damn it! <laughs> come on, come at me. Go, Leo, time to avenge your fallen bros. Whoa, okay, she's doing crazy high damage. Just gonna use the mummy to. Regenerate my health a bit. Uh oh, not good. This frame is completely restrained. There is no way out. Damn! That was easier than I expected. How would you like to die? There is no way out. I have added emergency escape to the main menu. Please select emergency escape. What do you mean? After detaching the cockpit, I will blow up Jeopardy. No! I do not understand. What do you mean by no? Just shut up. Let me think. There must be something we can do. What you are doing is a contradiction. You say you want to protect people. Are your life and your passengers' lives not also to be protected? Shut up! No means no. There is little time. Please understand. What exactly do you not want to do? You will get out with me! What? <laughs> At least he's consistent. Leo's obviously prioritizing um, the sexy robot voice. I jest, surely anyone would never want to give up their giant robot when they finally got their hands on one. Huh. Well done. I should take you more seriously. I should take you more seriously. <laughs> I'm sure any kid who watched Gundam, um, Transformers, or uh, Power Rangers always wanted their own giant mech. I think standing mid-range is probably the safest bet here, because I don't want to get too close to those dual blades she's got in her hands. Those look very dangerous, yep. And it's a bit hard because I need to try and heal. Also, I need to stay far enough away that she won't hit me with that homing missile. Damage to the 
I'm not really sure how I'm doing that, but there's like a cash dan uh, dash cancel punch. And that one seems to be very useful against her. Oh wow, that was really lucky. I mean, that was totally intentional. How'd you like me now? It's all over. I never expected a kid like you would be my match. You brought this on yourself! You killed! I had no choice! <laughs> Poor kid. Why don't you just kill me now? I will! <laughs> Why did you stop? What's with you? Kill me. Don't say that! <laughs> I won't! You better keep this in mind, boy. In battle, every time you wonder whether or not to do something, you'll end up losing. I love the way that sword retracts. It is still alive. I don't want to take her life. I know. There is something that I must remind you. I must eject the cockpit next time. Do not repeat what you did last time. What? Y yes I am a mere program. A lifeless program. What you did to save me was very illogical. That's not true. I detect movement. I will put it in the monitor. That's him! They have resorted to final measures. They're going to destroy us and the entire colony. The entire colony? The colony has a transportation unit to the spaceport. They've set several explosive devices there. If they explode, the colony will falter in its orbital rotation and fall into Jupiter. No. That's how important that orbital frame is to them. So I'd like you to work for us one more time. What? You go and find the bombs. Me? I watched you fight against the Red One. I have to admit, you're better than I am. You are the only one who can save the colony. No. I don't want to do that. Leo, listen to me. You go find them. I don't want to get involved anymore. I've had enough. Why me? Why always me? Let's go. What? Let's go and find them, Leo. This is something you can do. Salvis, I'll come with you. So let's go. No, you can't. It's too dangerous. We were just lucky that we survived. Next time, we may not be so lucky. I know. And I know... You'll protect me. Right? Salvis. Huh? Oh my god. That's so messed up. I'm genuinely shocked. I didn't think she was in a state to get back up. You need this done to you. Selvis? Selvis! 
please! And I know... you protect me. Damn! Viola! <laughs> Time to settle our fight. Come to Spaceport. I'll be waiting. Jeez. They just don't have any qualms about killing kids in this. What on earth is that? Oh, it's a raptor, I think. I think I'm going to stop this video after this fight. Or, no, here. Um. I'll just wait till the scene ends. Leo. Could you please take care of Salvis for me? I will. I'll take care of her. You take care of what you have to. I guess it's kind of interesting having a kid who actually acts like a bit of a kid. Ada, time to go. Roger. Jehuti ready for action. Let's rock. An electromagnetic freight packet will be jettisoned out to the center of the colony. We will be ejected with containers around us, so be careful. What? Well, there's no save point. This is a bit of a disaster. I'm gonna have to do this in one run, it looks like. Transportation route is confirmed. We will arrive at our destination in approximately five minutes. There is no immediate danger of hitting any obstacles. What a relief. I hope Salvis is alright. Are you concerned about her? Well, yes. Of course I am. Can we talk? If you do not mind. No, I don't mind. I have calculated the expected rate of crew survival for the present mission. In a best case scenario, there is an 8.7% rate of survival. I see. You have asked for numerous transfers from your duties aboard Jehuti. You have also had many chances to do so. May I ask why you are still here? Are you preaching to me again? No, I am simply asking out of curiosity. Well, I really don't know. Based on past experience, I can offer several plausible reasons. One, an overestimation of your fighting abilities based on an underestimation of the enemy's war potential. Two, Desire for a reward in proportion to the danger of exposure to self-destruction. 3. Emotional revenge for placing your crew's life in danger. Maybe you're right. But I really don't know myself. Whatever your reason, it is not logical. It is still possible for you to go back now. I do not want you to die. Ada... Well, can I tell you a story from when I was growing up? Please. I've been alone since I was a boy. My father and mother were rarely at home. We hardly went out anywhere together. When I was 10 years old, my father was posted to Jupiter, so we went out for a rare family dinner together. I was so happy. But... During the entire meal, my father and mother were fighting over who would take me. They weren't arguing to get me. They both wanted to get rid of me. I shouldn't laugh at that. That only reinforced my belief that I was an unwanted child. 
my friends and my teachers too. It's always been like that. I was the child no one wanted. Nobody will be upset if I'm gone. Even if I die, there would be no one to mourn my loss. The reason I stay here is because I'm needed. Selvis and you are by my side and... <laughs> there are even people to give me orders when I don't understand what's going on. There are people who need me finally. And for that, I'll devote my life to them. Are you saying that you would sacrifice your life, your only life, for someone else? I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. I feel that together we can do it. We are almost at the central hub. There are sure to be many enemy orbital frames. It is expected that the battle will begin as soon as we arrive at the central hub. Please be very careful. Yes, sure. I am. What? I am one of those who need you. I am incapable of feeling sorrow. But do not throw your life away so easily. I understand. Thank you. We will be arriving at the central hub in a matter of moments. Oh, okay, it looks like we're going to leave it there then, because that's a good save point. And I'm guessing the end section is going to be really difficult, especially the final boss. Um, wow, well that was a bit of an emotional roller coaster, and I thought it was quite... I, I quite like how the character development is in this story. Um, I quite like how Leo has grown, because he seemed kind of annoying at the beginning, but now that he makes a lot more sense, which I quite like. Anyway guys, until next time, which will be the final part of our Zone of the Enders playthrough. Until then, bye.